Hello. How is everybody? Lord, it's good to see y'all. I've been, Lord, I'm going to tell y'all, it is humid. It is hot and humid. My hair, Lord, as y'all can see, I need a haircut, but, um, my hair holds heat. It's, um, it's a very thick and coarse grain hair, and so it just holds heat, and then it starts sweating, and sweat get on my forehead and come down my cheek, and I don't like sweat. I don't like sweat. No, I don't like sweat. So, I, Lord, I try to stay in the house. I don't know if it's going to rain there or not. If it is, I'm put my ferns out there in the grass. But let me tell y'all what I was thinking this morning. You know, people have some strange sayings. I, I remember Grandma, she used to say when you was eating something like a, maybe a, one of them cinnamon rolls or a jelly-filled donut, she'd say, now you make sure you get the goody out of it. And Lord, I always wondered what the goody was. I was like, Lord, Grandma, what is the goody? And she said, well, you know, the jelly, the filling. And, you know, folks say, well, well, make sure you get the goody out of it. Get the, get the goody in. Uh, somebody ate some, uh, I'm on a, on a diet and lost a little bit of weight. But, um, I bought some Atkins M&M's, and they're pretty good. But one of I, I came up short a few M&M's, and I said, well, Lord, I said, um, I said, Lord, help us. Um, I said, somebody done tried to get my sweets. Get in my sweets. And that's just so funny. You know, the way people will come up with words to describe things. Sweets and for cigarettes, they'll say your smokes and your, um, your, like your eats. If you, your food is your eats. I, I like the way the old people talk. You know, the older generation. It's so funny. Let me tell y'all, I saw this picture on Facebook of these children riding in a, in the back of a pickup truck. And it said, you know, press like if you did this and enjoyed it. I did, but let me tell y'all, one time, it, it, it reminded me of a, of, a, of, a, of a memory. One time, daddy and mama and my brother and sister and two or three children or from the youth group at the church went fishing. And, um... I went down yonder with them, and Lord, we were going down the road. I was on the tailgate. Well, we didn't live, but Lord, a tenth of a mile from the pond. I mean, it was right, almost right across the street. Lord, my hair. Um, and I was riding on the tailgate, and Daddy pulled out of that driveway and got on that road. And Lord, I fell off that tailgate, and I probably bounced a good 60 feet. Just bounced, boom, 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 just rolled. My head had two or three... Just not really gashes, just indentions where the they had just put the they had just redone the road, put asphalt down, and put rocks on top of it. And Lord, I'm gonna tell you, I heard like hell. I said, "Whoo, my goodness!" But that picture reminded me of that. Let me tell y'all another story. Um, I was looking out the kitchen window yesterday, talking to my mom on the telephone, and. I heard somebody yell and looked out there was this woman running down the sidewalk. Didn't have no shoes on. Had on a pair of shorts that Grandma called them coochie cutters. I mean, they were some high shorts. And running, who she was running for everything she was worth. And um, she took off down the road and I mean, was, you know, running. I mean, who help us. And didn't have a shirt one on. All she had on was a brazier. I said, well, I'll be damned. I said, whoo, help us, Jesus. I don't know what she was running from, but I said, whoo, whoo, my gracious. Um, I'm going to tell you, I'm, I'm very happy today. My, my good friend has a German shepherd named Zuck. And Zuck has been ill. He, he's, his glucose levels were very messed up and... So he's been at the doctor, been in the vet's office, and had surgery. And it was a, I don't really know the surgery and all that, but it was a concern because Zuck is, he, he's a little older and not in the best of health. But he came through and is doing good. Ain't y'all glad about that? Anyway, I just was going to check in with y'all. I, I love y'all. I'll tell your mom and them that I asked how they're doing and, um, the, and, and, um, that, Anyway, tell, tell them I'm going to check on y'all sometime. Tell my name, I'm going to call them, check on them sometime. And I'll talk to y'all directly now. Bye.